Hey all you cool cats and kittens. This is Callie. Like there's Mouse. I know she's sitting up where she's not supposed to be. Because sometimes you just can't ca uh, make cats mind. They have a mind of their own. Anyways. I got, I got a cheeky subway for dinner. Subway. Two foot long meatball sets. Uh, look what else I got. I got myself a brand new skillet. That's right. A brand new skillet mainstays, four quart jumbo cooker. I think this thing was like $10. It's got a nice lid, handle on the side. It's like a beauty in it. Mm-hmm. I got I got mad last night and threw my threw my skillet in the trash. <laughs> I know that sounds horrible, but I had that thing like ten over ten years. I think I had that thing like I wanna say thirteen years. Anyway. I got it when I Thinking back in 2008 when my ex-husband, I kicked him out. Yeah, I know. I kicked him to the curb. I'm a horrible person. Kicked him to the curb. That's what he told everybody. For no reason. He didn't do nothing. And I agreed. I said, yeah, you, you didn't do nothing. You didn't work. You didn't take care of the house. You didn't help with the kids. You didn't help with paying bills. And I said, right, you just go ahead and tell people you didn't do nothing because you didn't do anything. All right, anyway, so we got this new skillet here. It has a, the coat that come off my skillet and I had uh, fried something and it got stuck. I ran it to the dishwasher twice and it was still uh, stuck. So stuff in there was stuck. And I was like, you know, I'm just not fooling with that no more. I, I trashed it down in the dumpster last night. <laughs> oh, yeah. I was like, you know, I, I thought about it, you know, if I put it over into my trash can, I, I probably would have felt guilty and uh, clogging up the landfill. So I made a point of taking it out and actually physically throwing it into the dumpster. Yeah, now it's gone. So I uh, went to Walmart where I got this lovely skillet and I bought some uh, Easter flowers for myself. Mouse thinks they smell pretty. She thinks they're for her. I didn't tell her any different. I said, yeah. Mommy bought her girl some flowers. She still had some back over here. Brighten up the kitchen. I only paid uh, $4.87 for them flowers. Anyways, made some blueberry muffins this morning. And put them on that cupcake covered thing. I got it at the Target Dollar Spot. So we're about halfway through our kitchen deep cleaning process. I cleaned out the refrigerator, re rearranged the magnets. I know I got a box of I got trash over here I need to take out. And uh, we got it all fixed up. Yeah, happy Easter there. Anyway, I got some dirty dishes in the sink from my early this morning. I went want me some bananas. Bananas. <sighs> bananas and good, or uh, orange juice are good together. I mean, they don't taste good, but they, uh, the orange juice, the vitamin C helps your body absorb the potassium in the bananas. And, uh, I wasn't going to borrow this, but my abuela said, Abuelita, or whatever her name is, she's like, come on and borrow this authentic Mexican chocolate drink mix. And I was like, come on, abuela. I don't really need that. And she's like, you do, you do. You do, Callie. See? See, she's giving me that knowing look. And I was like, all right. I'll buy some and give it a try. 
She said it was special. There's nothing special about it. But we're gonna try it. Oh my god. Kitchen over here cleaned up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Water bowl cleaned up. Cat food all situated over here. I had some ants come in, so I put the plate in the put the plate in that little that little dish thing right there. Filled up water because ants can't swim. There's an ant right now, see? See him? See him? You see him? Mm, he's a dead one now. And you know, they come around it every month they're supposed to be. And uh, charge me five dollars to uh, pest control. But apparently, they're not doing too good a job at pest control. If we're still getting ants. Right, Mouse? Mouse is like, as long as I don't, can't get to my food, it's all good. Ants can't swim, honey. She done made a mess of that food. I'm going to have to clean that up again. She throws in little biscuit pieces over and they swell up and makes a mess. Makes a mess. Yes, it does. She's like this. So this is what she does. This is how we probably get ants to. She'll grab a, a bike mouthful and she'll take it over into the floor and eat it. And then uh, she doesn't exactly sometimes always get it all ate. She leaves little crumbs behind. So you should see she's doing it again. Anyway. I got my Easter cupcake wrapper all ready. We're having this Unicorn from Fitty. Cupcakes. Strawberry. Mm -hmm. So what we're having on Easter. Maybe. And I bought. <laughs> I bought another cake too. I bought a, a coconut cake. It's in the freezer. In case I'm not. In the mood to make cupcakes. You know sometimes you just. You just ain't into that. Then if that's the case, I'll just save the cupcake things for later. <sighs> Alright, people. Let's go back to look at our pretty flowers. In our pan. This is Callie. I'm back. I, I want to show you something else real quick before I forget. Uh... I want to give a shout out to Diane at the Hummingbird Nest. And uh, when I was out, I saw these little uh, romper set. You know, it's, a, it's got a Winnie Pooh. It's got Winnie Pooh pocket. And one of the pockets says, Honey, it's got to be. And it uh, reminded me of that jumper dress I bought her last year. I think it was last year. Anyway, this one's a 12 month, so I thought it'd be cute for her. I'm gonna send that send that to her with some happy mail here soon. Uh, isn't that pretty? I'll send that as happy mail. Uh, the reason I brought it up was, uh, you know, she still needs some support, so you wanna go over there and and help her out with the donation to her PayPal. That would be really nice of you. Uh, you know, she's she's having a hard time. She's got two types of cancer, and uh, she's just getting over COVID. I'm sure she, I'm sure she can use the support and encouragement. If anything, just say some prayers for her, okay? So, I bought this for Diane. And, uh, the hummingbird nest. Isn't that cute? <laughs> they got a new pocket for your best furs. You put your best fur in your pocket. You know, honey. Anyway, that's cute. Alright. Oh, I'm going to take on some footage that I took when I was at Walmart. I almost bought that He Man set. Uh, I didn't. I was, I was nice. It wasn't in my budget anyway. <laughs> Can't afford to buy it. It's like, oh. 
because I have to be a responsible adult and, and uh, pay bills and stuff. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed my footage that I'm, I'm going to tack on here. This is Callie's, with Callie's room with Reborn's cats and nonsense. I hope you enjoyed the nonsense going on around here. Sometimes I enjoy it and sometimes I'm just wanting to get away. Too much nonsense, right? A little nonsense now and then relished by the wisest men. You know, Gene Wilder said that in Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory. Anyway, I'll catch you cool cats and kittens back here another time. Oh yeah, you better get out there and get your Easter stuff. If you're needing any Easter stuff, on Walmart was like you're really getting slim pickings there over there. Slim pickings. You better hurry up. Look, it's it's Captain Crunch pancake and Captain Crunch syrup. Callie's got to get some of that. Get it, Callie, get it. I usually buy this Jiffy here, and it's 47 cents. But I noticed Tillsbury come out with one for 44 cents. Mmm, frugal. Okay, so we're over in the pajama apartment. And I got this. It's a sleep gown shirt. But I, I like it and all, but I don't want a sleep gown shirt. I want this print in pajamas. But they don't have it. They got this print here. This print here. I just can't do that. What do you think? That's too way loud, way loud. No. She's happy. No. Ooh, look at that. It's He-Man and Skeletor. Ooh, yes. He-Man, most powerful man in the universe. Skeletor, evil lord of destruction. All hail Skeletor. He man is coming to get you. Oh, no, he, retro play. Mm -hmm. Modern posing retro play. Oh gosh. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> You like Skeletor? Are you Team Skeletor? Mm-hmm. Oh, hey, man. Bye, Skeletor. Hey, look. You yeah, got Battle Cat, too. You can get Battle Cat. Battle Cat's um, $24.86. And the figurines are $14.92 a piece. Just in case anybody wanted you run to the Walmart and get you one. Look, his saddle comes off and everything. Ain't that the most awesome thing you've seen in a long time? I know. I know.